we kind of really looked at the Preen Girls, so we looked at what we've been working on and, and what's been really successful for the Preen Girl, and we thought, so she's got something to go to a party in, she's got really cool things to hang out the weekend, let's think about a few things she can go to work in. We're doing a lavender mauve look, which is, you know, kind of like a tough girl, nice easy skin liner, but it's done in mauve tones and pink tones, so it's softer and it's sheer, and we're using actually like this lavender color on the cheek, which is kind of unusual and strong, but sheer. So it's like a soft but strong look, and it's unusual, and I said that already. I suppose this is like a, a girl or a woman that's very good at doing a hair but for today and not kind of referenced. So it's very modern and fresh looking, but um, just a knot and a bun at the back with a little ponytail. Um, super simple, um, but just kind of, you know, we use like a couple of uh, bobby pins, a really nice shape on the head. Um, and that's kind of it. It's just super simple and very kind of elegant and chic. Well, I guess um, initially she was kind of younger and more kind of like you know had a more streety vibe to her and then i think as we have developed and she's developed we've kind of grown with her and and now before she used to go to clubs now she goes to cocktail parties We worked with Jeeves and Hawks from London because they had the tradition and the history and the quality and then we designed some new pieces so that's been a really interesting collaboration and I think it's quite nice and, and we've injected that into the collection but we've mixed it with like a rose print, very English, very feminine print so you get that masculine feminine vibe. Mm. We were very interested in layering um, and also wrapping and twisting and just the idea for winter you want to feel snug and warm but at the same time you still want to look sexy so we were playing with that idea as well, still bringing in the masculine and feminine and trying to meld that together. We've really played with, we've got like cashmere knits and we really played with like making them really tiny and then making some of the wool coats really massive. So it's really playing with proportion a little bit as well and just, just sort of like pushing what, what wouldn't possibly be expected and, and just trying to um, create like a few new silhouettes as well.
We launched Preen Line, which is our second line, because we wanted to retain that younger, more easy, casual approach to the collection. So we gave them a separate sort of identity of their own, and, and that's really worked for us to do that, because it means we can really concentrate on the, the show collection, really focus it on that high-end kind of designer market, and then we have the Preen Line, which is the easy, cool, accessible pieces. We're just basically looking at the modern woman, so the modern woman has many aspects of, of her wardrobe and she wants something to wear to work, something to wear out, and we're really mixing, playing with it, like seasons are sort of meld, melding together and we're looking at like, you know, why do you have to wear silks and florals in the summer, why can't you mix them with beautiful cashmeres for the winter, and so we have that really, pieces that can stay in your wardrobe and can be worn at all different seasons as well.